Hello guys, I hope you're well and having a lovely day. Thank you so much for joining me. As you can see from the video title, I am going to be doing a H&M haul. And this is inspired by, obviously, the new season, which is really exciting. Autumn is just my favourite. I just think it's so exciting to get a bit more festive and cosy. Autumn is all about layers and I feel like that's when fashion just thrives and I'm just very excited for it. And as well as I wanted to make a video for you guys sharing with you what I personally think are key investment pieces that you would maybe think about investing into for this season which will really nicely bring you into winter. You don't actually have to shop these pieces per se but maybe you have these pieces already in your wardrobe or for instance a blazer that you already have in your wardrobe and I hope that I'm just going to inspire you with how to style it. So without further ado everything will be linked down below if it's out of stock. I will leave some similars. My Instagram, my TikTok, my like to know it page which is a page basically where you can shop all my wardrobe and my jewellery and my interiors. Everything will be there. Everything will be linked down below as well as some discount codes. So definitely just go and check it out if you haven't already. And if you haven't already, please like and subscribe on this channel as well as it really supports me. And yeah, let's get into the video. Okay, I'm going to do the haul in categories. And the first category is outerwear. I think outerwear is the key investment piece, I would say, that we all kind of look into when it comes to autumn, winter. And I want to make sure that I'm sharing with pieces with you that I know you're going to love and wear with different layers and different outfits and different seasons. So the first one is a trench coat. And I think these are the most timeless investment coats that you definitely need in your wardrobe, especially in the UK. Autumn's quite a warm month. So I think having these light jackets is perfect. I don't want the thick coats just yet. So I'd really recommend a trench coat. And this one is from And Other Stories. If you didn't know already, H&M has been a, an amazing place to shop at the moment and I'm really enjoying it. On H&M you are now able to shop And Other Stories, Arquette and Cos. And I believe Weekday and Monkey. The companies that fall under the belt of H&M, you are able to shop all of them on H&M which I just think makes life so much easier and you can compare prices and pieces just amazing but anyway so i picked up this short trench coat from and other stories and i just absolutely love it i think they're just a very classic timeless coat to have in your wardrobe they're super lightweight as well so really easy to wear different times of the year and you can layer them and they're really amazing for for the rainy season but they look also really nice when it's nice and sunny with lighter colors you just can't go wrong you're just gonna see so much wear out of them i have had my trenches for many many years and this year I just felt like I needed to invest into a shorter one it's a really nice reasonable price the quality of it is incredible and I just adore the details and yeah I get so much wear out of it. So another coat that I would maybe say to look at investing into is a lighter jacket. I think this one also falls under the belt of that over shirt style. I really like the utility and smartness of this jacket. I think it just gives it more versatility when it comes to wearing during the day and also at night time because it's still quite smart. I really love this one. This is from Arquette and I just love the details of it. Really love this grey colour as well. I think we're going to see quite a lot of grey and metallics within this season. But yeah, I've seen quite a few and they're quite timeless and I love the structure of this. Super comfortable. The material is beautiful and again, you can wear this quite casually with just a t-shirt and a pair of jeans. The other day I did style it with my Chanel brooch just to really elevate it and I think that looked absolutely stunning. So again, just a really lovely piece that you are going to see doing really well in your wardrobe within the autumn season and the winter season. The last outerwear piece that I picked up on the H&M haul is a blazer. I don't need to say this as you may already know but blazers are just the classic outerwear piece to have in your wardrobe. They are super amazing for the versatility of wearing during the day and night time. It's also an amazing workwear piece. I came across this one because I really love the style of it. It's in this beautiful mini dog tooth print and it's got brown tones running through it 
and I just absolutely adore it. Super timeless. I can see this in autumn and spring being paired with like a white mini dress. I think that would look absolutely stunning. But also as well with roll neck. So beautiful. But yes, like I said, you cannot go wrong with having a blazer in your wardrobe. It's just such an easy, classic and effortless piece to chuck on. And you look very smart and put together. And they're a really good lightweight piece to layer. I really like in the warmer seasons when you don't want to wear a jacket but you feel like you need something just to cover your shoulders. I really like with blazers just chucking it over the shoulders like this, kind of like a cape and I just think it looks very elegant and very chic. I do think the most worn outerwear pieces that I do wear are blazers and trench coats. You just cannot go wrong. I'm going to talk about tops now and tops that I have obviously picked up within this haul and also which I think would work really well in your autumn wardrobe. I'm going to start with basics because I feel like and I know that sounds so simple and so easy to say but this is your reminder because I had to remind myself to invest into or maybe refresh your basic wardrobe because it definitely makes such a difference when it comes to styling and putting outfits together. I just actually invested into this top from Reformation and I absolutely adore it. It's just such an easy basic top and it's so snuggly but I really like the characteristics of it. I really like this high neck and the shoulders. I just I think it elevates a basic outfit so easily. I'm just pairing it with a pair of jeans and I feel really put together. I have recently actually got rid of all my basic t-shirts because I have had them for so many years and they just look a little bit ratty now and some of my white t-shirts have gone a bit grey and the material has just been so worn because I've had these for years and they're pieces that I wear pretty much every day. I felt like it was time to invest into higher quality basics. So I picked up a couple from and other stories and and these are quite affordable actually. These are £19 and I picked them up in black and in white. The quality of them is just amazing. There's, like I said, on H&M, there is quite an array of basics you can shop from, like I said, on Arquette, H&M, Cos, all of them. So when you are doing your shop, maybe just quickly add a couple of white and black t-shirts. This works just perfectly with a blazer, a trench coat, the lighter coat. It's just a very easy staple to have in your wardrobe. But I would say definitely invest into just your classic white and black and maybe a grey top. You just cannot go wrong. And the quality of a top makes an outfit look so different. Trust me. The next top I would say you must definitely have in your autumnal wardrobe and pretty much every season is a shirt. And I'm going to be showing you in a form of a very extravagant shirt. But how cool is this shirt? So fun. But yes, I would really recommend investing into, or if you have one already, just a classic white shirt, maybe a blue and white pinstripe shirt. They're just such easy pieces to have in your wardrobe to chuck on. A really good layering piece because it's quite light, but you've still got your arms covered for when it gets a little bit more chillier. But I did come across this shirt and I just think it is amazing. It's just a classic grey pinstripe shirt with these kind of crystal diamantes covering it and I just think it's so fun and I think this literally screams the perfect day to night shirt. It is just so fun and what I love about it is that it can literally just elevate such a basic outfit and again you can wear this with maybe tailored trousers and a pair of trainers or you can dress this up with some jeans and some silver heels back in that just look incredible but I just thought this was such an easy way to bring yourself in to the party wear season maybe you're someone who's not very much into dresses so this is a really nice way to really dress up your outfits if you're more into your, your shirts and your suits this also could look really lovely with a pair of leather jeans or some skinny jeans but yeah I thought this was a really nice piece to have in your wardrobe if your personal style isn't very dressy um I would really recommend this I think it's so gorgeous. It's a really nice cropped shirt. I think it's a really nice piece to invest into instead of sequins. I think sequins can be very dated where this I think it's just something else. And again, you could definitely wear this in like winter for spring. You can wear this really anywhere, like 
you can really casual this down you can wear this for work you can wear this for the evenings i just think it's just such a good piece to have in your wardrobe i think this is absolutely stunning and again like i said and i think it's just very like effortless and it just looks so cool i absolutely love it i picked it up in an extra small and i'd say it's a really good true to size style it is designed to be a little bit oversized but yeah this is amazing another blouse i picked up i don't know if you can see it properly but it is this really gorgeous sheer organza halter neck blouse and it's got this gorgeous extravagant bow and it's absolutely beautiful and really affordable as well. I picked up in an extra small. As you can see, it's very sheer. So if you are comfortable with that, with a really gorgeous bra underneath, then amazing. But also as well, what I would really suggest with this is having like maybe a really classic bralette or a really nice high neck vest to go with this so it really flows and it doesn't give that illusion of like a vest underneath like if you had a high neck vest like maybe this top it's not too obvious like of the layers and i think it just makes it a little bit more chicer but yeah i absolutely love this and definitely again dress up and dress down this is a really lovely layering top as well so again you can wear this with a blazer a really nice leather jacket also as well you could wear it with a jumper with with the bow over the top i think that would look so beautiful as well in this video i styled it with just a pair of jeans and some silver heels and i just thought that looked really cool you could wear this during the day or at night time but i just thought it was a really lovely piece and i just thought it was really affordable very timeless very chic and a really lovely piece to you know you can get so much wear out of and if you're stuck with what to wear i just for an evening i just know that if i just wear an all black outfit i feel really put together i feel chic so having people pieces like this in my wardrobe which are timeless but a little bit more statement goes a long long way as i've said we are going into the colder months so we do need to start investing in to knitwear and i absolutely adore this jumper i would really recommend when it comes to knitwear especially for autumn and for spring I would really recommend cardigans because I think they are a little bit more versatile. I think we should maybe do a shot every time I say versatile because I swear I say versatile in every for every product, for every video that I film. But that is just my goal is to really share with you versatile pieces that I know you're going to get so much wear out of them. As I digress, I would really recommend cardigans because you can wear them on their own but also as well you can wear them as a layering piece um, with t-shirts under Underneath. so when it gets too warm you can take the cardigan off and also as well you can have it over your shoulders really nice with little slip skirts or dresses so i found this one on and other stories so beautiful what i love about it is it gives a nod to the kind of cropped jacket trend we're seeing quite a lot of which is inspired by chanel and celine but what i do like about this is it's quite long line so i think it gives it gives a bit more ways to style i really love that we're seeing this really gorgeous like really really cozy easy soft fluffy material but then it's been given a structure casual material but it's been structured with this really gorgeous kind of like thick wax rib it's not wax but it's that like really hard structure collar and really hard structured detail still soft but it just gives a bit more formality to the cardigan this does come in black as well which i'm definitely thinking about and um, investing into i picked up a small so usually it would be an extra small in down double stories but i'm glad i went for a little bit oversized just to give me the option to wear layers underneath it has also some really nice chic cream gold buttons as well and again like i said it comes in black and also i think i did see it the other day in red and pink so if you are looking to invest into a bit of pop of color i will leave that down below as well but you just cannot go wrong with a cream cardigan so i have been styling it open at the moment with a little vests underneath but yeah i cannot wait to style this with some really nice tailored trousers and all done up and all nice and cozy it literally just gives autumn winter cozy vibes and i'm very much here for it another piece i picked up is a knitted dress again we're gonna see so much wear out of these maybe it's a tad too warm at the moment but the temperature is going to drop next week so at the moment Moment, I would be wearing these with just my bare legs and a pair of boots but then again into the 
winter colder season with maybe some layers you could wear like a really nice turtleneck underneath and some tights would also still look very gorgeous and i absolutely adore it i'm really gutted because it is such a beautiful cream the material is super soft i really like the characteristics of it this really gorgeous v-neck and the long kind of cuff sleeves that you can roll up or keep long i think they really elevate the outfit however unfortunately it is a little bit too big on me and this is the smallest size they did so sadly it will be returning i wanted to still share this with you because it's such a beautiful timeless jumper i have a cream jumper that i have had for maybe six years and it is the piece that i always go to when it's a little bit colder but still warm enough to wear your bare legs i just think it's such a gorgeous autumnal outfit now i'm gonna go on to bottoms and i've started to look for and i am on hunt for pair of jeans i have a pair of jeans from zara which i absolutely adore i'm wearing them now but i think the color of them is very still summer vibes so i'm looking for a bit more cooler tone darker tone jeans so i picked up this pair from h&m and i just as you can see i'm really adoring gray at the moment and i really like the fit of these they are a tiny bit big for me so i'm going to definitely order them size down so at the moment these are a size six but i think i have to order a size four they are designed to be baggy jeans these are baggy wide loose fit mid-waist denim jeans so it says it in the name but they're a little bit too oversized so i think i'm going to try a size down however everything else is just perfection i like the style where they sit on my hip i'm really cool i'm really comfortable and i just love that they are flare jeans and they go down to the bottom i really enjoy that look as it's super comfortable definitely can dress these up and dress these down i wore these with some silver heels and i just think that looks really cool as well as some boots sticking out the bottom as well as trainers and what i really like about this gray pair is that they're a bit more versatile to dress up for the evening so with some silver statement shoes and silver statement earrings it's going to look phenomenal as you can see i styled it with the blouse so i just wanted to share with you the cute blouse and pair of jeans look and then i paired it with some really gorgeous and other story pointy quartz heels which i'll leave down below as well because they do come in silver so definitely get your hands on those but yeah i really like these i really like the fit of them i really love the color i think they're really gorgeous this really nice like light washed gray like i said it gives it a bit more versatility this like light color i think it's a really nice color for during the day paired with a white shirt maybe but also as well really lovely for styling with black in the evening so trousers that i also found that i was missing in my wardrobe is tailored trousers so before i went away i picked up a pair of these gorgeous gray minky cream tailored trousers and i absolutely love them and they're really affordable as well so i picked them up in two different colorways so i picked them up in a classic black and also in this really nice like beige cream and i absolutely adore them i'm gonna see so much wear out of them these are gonna be like my absolute hero staples throughout all seasons you definitely cannot go wrong with a black pair but also as well if you're bored of wearing black then definitely get a pair of these really lovely with just classic t-shirts dressing up and dressing down really like the fit of them they're a really nice length for me as well tailored trousers are a definite in your wardrobe and i absolutely love these and like i said i'm five foot four and i'd say that these were really good length for me and i'm just super obsessed with them and really affordable as well which i'm really happy with so i'll leave these down below they do come in a couple of different colors as well as they i think these do sell out quite quickly because they are quite popular however they i have noticed that they do restock them so just save them on your h&m account and you will be notified when these are back in stock and again i am just falling in love with gray apparently i picked up these tailored trousers as well i absolutely adore them this really gorgeous just dark gray with a pinstripe i actually wore these on a night out and with a black waistcoat and i think that looked absolutely beautiful but again these are more focused for wearing for like during the day however i love that i could wear these at night time with some silver heels i think the silver metallic heels just give such a difference and elevation to your outfit just a pop of color or metallic just really elevates your outfit and makes it so much more fun i'm not a massive colorful wardrobe girl as you may have noticed so having the option to add a little bit of metallic in my wardrobe 
or a pop of color through my accessories. I really enjoy doing it that way and then investing into really subtle neutral colors. Um, I think that's the way forward with me. But yeah, I really love these. The quality of them again is really nice. These are really affordable and really nice length and fit around the waist. They're really beautiful and I just love the quality of them. They're really good. So before I finish on this note, other bottoms that I would recommend maybe looking into invest in are slip skirts. I think slip skirts go a long way. I have a couple in my wardrobe that I just have on repeat because I just wear them so much. I wear them like trousers. They're just so easy to style. I would recommend getting a black and a cream. And another pair of trousers I would recommend looking into is leather trousers. I wear mine so much and again i will leave them down below yeah guys that's the end of my h&m haul and i hope you enjoyed the way i've done this sharing with you kind of like autumnal staples like i said everything will be linked down below thank you so much for watching if you haven't already please like and subscribe and definitely go and check me out on my other social platforms because over there you'll see me styling pieces a lot more but yeah thank you again for watching i hope you have a lovely rest of your day and I will see you in the next video.